So there's getting to be a lot less of these barns sitting around. And I'm sure a lot of people will be sad to see this barn go. But the reason we're getting rid of it today is it's kind of a hazard for our cattle. Because they can get in some of these areas and there's nails everywhere. And you can see it's falling down and we're kind of worried that someday uh, it, when there's a snowstorm coming, the cattle will get close to the barn trying to get out of the wind and it might collapse on them. And also some of the, some of the cows are too big to get into the door, but the calves, we oftentimes see them getting into this barn. And so the plan is to burn it and that way it gets rid of this safety hazard. So for fuel, we got, I don't know, about seven gallons of diesel. And there's probably about one and a half gallons left of gasoline in here. And we're gonna mix the two because the diesel burns a little bit longer and it's not as explosive as the gasoline. And so we just like, we just like to mix them so it's a little bit safer and then we'll uh find a dry spot in this barn because the roof is a little wet yet but we're thinking it'll dry as the barn burns so as you can see the roof is pretty caved in we probably shouldn't be standing in here but uh we're gonna try to find something dry so good for 100 years we'll probably stay another 20 minutes <laughs> Ready? Yeah, here we go. This is gonna be hot. Holy crap! <clears throat> so it's been kind of wet the last couple days, so we're not worried about this fire spreading too much. It's even starting to sprinkle right now. One nice thing about burning this barn is uh, it's insured for 40,000. Just kidding. So on this north side, we're pretty sure that the only reason the barn hasn't collapsed is because this tree and you can see the trees starting to bend quite a bit but i think it's been supporting the barn from falling for the last five years at least stuff that whole barn is kind of damp and it's taking forever for it to light up so moist. it's moist so we're hoping we give it a couple minutes and and she'll lighten up push it onto itself that way nothing can crawl underneath it and maybe it'll start burning better if we get more wood up on top of the fire.
Jeepers. Didn't know it was gonna rain like this. We were hoping it'd light up a lot faster, get more drone video of it. But it's nice not to have to worry about that barn falling on cattle anymore. Gonna have to come back up here when it's done burning and so we can get rid of all the nails. We'll probably have to hire someone to dig a hole and push it into. I don't know, wasn't the best video, but hope you thought it was a little bit enjoyable. Thanks for watching.